Welcome to The Terrible Take, a daily segment telling Steelers Nation what's on our mind. I'm Dave Bryan. The 2022 NFL Scouting Combine is now underway in Indianapolis, and the Thursday night event features the quarterbacks, wide receivers, and tight ends all going through the underwear Olympics. Included in that tight end group is Connor Hayward, who of course is a younger brother of Pittsburgh Steelers defensive tackle Cameron Hayward. The younger Hayward, a Michigan State product, is the shortest of the tight end group at 5 foot 11 and 1 8. Technically, Connor Hayward is a fullback H-back type, and that's why he is working with the tight end group this year. At Michigan State, Hayward was super versatile as he not only caught 96 passes for 711 yards and 6 touchdowns, but he also rushed 211 times for another 825 yards and another 5 touchdowns. That versatility, along with his ability to play on special teams, might just get him drafted this year in the later rounds. While the Steelers currently have a versatile Hayward-type player under contract for the 2022 season in Derek Watt, the Steelers certainly could use someone on their roster this summer to back him up. Watt, by the way, did not have near the college production at Wisconsin that Hayward had at Michigan State. The Steelers love NFL bloodlines as evidenced by all the set of brothers they have under contract right now. In addition to the Watt brothers, the Steelers still have the Edmonds brothers and Davis brothers, who are two young defensive tackles currently under contract. So with that, it won't be a bit surprising if the Steelers wind up drafting the younger Hayward in the later rounds this year. If indeed the younger Hayward winds up a member of the Steelers a few months from now, he might just wind up being the team's future starting fullback and core special teams player in 2023, as 2022 could be the final year in Pittsburgh for Derek Watt. So with that, make sure to keep an eye on Connor Hayward Thursday night. Be sure to follow us at SteelersDepot.com and check out episodes of The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. And check out The Terrible Podcast with myself and Alex Kazora every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.